Today I have on loan a very special instrument. This is a Kruger piccolo trumpet, handmade in Germany land by Kruger, and I, th I think that's how you pronounce your name, K-R-O with an umlaut over it, G-E-R, I think it's pronounced Kruger. Uh, this is an absolutely gorgeous piccolo trumpet, it's around 3,000 euros, so that's more than I earn in a week, um, and it is a gorgeous instrument. This is in raw brass, so it doesn't have any lacquer on it, um, uh, but what it does have, a lovely little interesting detail, is it has a snake as the brace uh, around the side of the instrument. Quite quite cool. Uh, it has four side action rotary valves, SARV, side action rotary valves, and a paddle on this side, which you can use to elongate uh, the third valve tuning slide. The instrument feels absolutely lovely in the hand, although you do get, because it's raw brass, you do get a bit of residue on there. Uh, it's made out of yellow brass, has a 100mm bell on the end of it. It's a range, uh, it, you can have it in a whole variety of different finishes and things like that. Um, it has a uh, lead pipe that's got E-N-D-R-E-S, Andre potentially is how that's pronounced, no idea. Um, and uh, it's a trumpet sized lead pipe, so I've just got a Shilke 12B4 mouthpiece in here because that's what was in front of me. Um, and uh, yeah. There's not a lot that I can say about this instrument because I don't really know a whole lot about it. Um, and uh, what I do know though is that it is fantastic to play. It uh, is great to hold. It doesn't have any sort of fragility to it. Um, the way that the uh, posts and the arrangement here for the valves is such that it feels really comfortable in the hand. The valves are all uh, the paddles for the valves are all stepped slightly higher than each other and the fourth valve paddle uh, is extended down a little bit further so it feels quite ergonomic. This bar that you can rest your thumb on is very solid. There's nothing sort of fragile about it. It, it feels very well made. It feels very good in the hand. So that's about it really. Uh, big thanks to Brendan for loaning this to me for the purpose of doing a video. If there's anything else you'd like to know about it, please uh, write a comment in the video description below. And thank you for watching.